Welcome to the tutorial using sample packs with AudioVolution Mobile. After you have downloaded one of our sample packs, you must first install it before AudioVolution can use it. So here we start the House Free Pack app and simply tap Install Sample Pack once. You will see that the app will start unpacking the samples and it will put them in the right directory so that AudioVolution can find them. Please wait until it says Unpacking finished and then exit the app by pressing the back button. So with the sample pack installed, it's time to start AudioVolution Mobile. So once started, we need to import samples from the sample pack, so tap on the folder icon on the top left. You will see several options to import samples, but the most convenient one for us now is import sample from sample pack. Here you can see all sample packs that are installed, and for this tutorial we will just choose the house pack. All the samples from this pack are listed here. And we'll just select a drum sample to start with. In the dialog that follows you can change the tempo and pitch of the sample we just selected. Now the sample was recorded at 128 beats per minute, but if your project would be at 100 beats per minute for instance, the app could stretch the sample to match your project's tempo. Similarly, the samples key could be matched to the key your project is in. But note that making large pitch and tempo changes can introduce artifacts, so it's best not to make radical changes. For this demo, we are just going to leave the tempo as is and import the drum sample right away. There it is, so let's listen to what it sounds like. Now we would like to loop the sample, so long tap the sample region and select repeat. Here we can define how many repetitions of the sample we would like to see, so let's choose 3. Now let's put the green time marker on 5 seconds and play from there to hear the sample looping. There, we have a perfect loop. Now let's get in some bass. In this case, let's change the pitch of this sample from A one note down to G. I need to choose the down button as well, otherwise the sample will get shifted up all the way to G in the next octave. So there's our bass sample, so let's hear it. Now that sounds cool, so let's repeat the sample once. And we'll do some more editing. We will turn on the grid and put it on 1 8 notes. We will select the edit tool and move the second sample partially on top of the first sample, all the way to the fifth bar. And by doing this we will remove the end notes of the first loop. So now you can hear that the bass simply plays on. As you can see we have one drum loop too many, so we are going to remove that by selecting the cross icon and tap the drum sample once. Now let's make a simple ending to this song. First go back into the scroll mode so that we can use the pop-up menu. We will repeat the second sample just once. Zoom out a little. Then we're going to select the edit tool and trim the sample down so that only the first three bass notes are being played. So there. This is the end of our tutorial. Please try the free sample packs for AudioVolution Mobile by Function Loops, which you can download from the Google Play Store. And if you like them, we have more loop packs as well just for a couple of euros.